I'm going to show you guys how to add custom fonts to stream elements overlays. It's that simple. So let's just go ahead and start the video. Real quick before we begin, guys, I'm GS Fear. I'm a content creator on both Twitch and YouTube dedicated to bringing you the best possible stream tips, tricks, and tutorials to help your stream stand out from all the rest. And I do stream Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, 8 p.m. EST to about 10.30 p.m. EST. If you have any questions or if you just want to watch me play some video games and kind of vibe out. So let's go to www.dafont.com. Now this is the website I use for pretty much all of the fonts I get. And you're going to download pretty much any of the fonts that you want. I downloaded last stream just because it kind of looked cool. So once you download it on the bottom, if you are using Chrome on the bottom, it will show laststream.zip or whatever font it is. So you're gonna click on that and then download one of the two right here. It's gonna have a .ttf. So laststream.ttf and then you're gonna hit install. So it's gonna start installing it right here. Now this is installed. So next step will be to log into stream elements. So stream elements.com hit my dashboard and then you're going to hit my overlays and you're going to create a blank overlay. Now, once you do that, I'm just going to kind of show you with mine on an already created overlay, but what you're going to do after that, you're going to come down to the plus button right here and then add stream tools. Now, once you do that, you're going to come over here to the layers and you're going to double click on it and it's going to show settings, position, size and style and text settings. Now, first off with the settings, I kind of like to have mine custom where the background is just kind of transparent. So come down here to the text settings and then you see where we have enable custom font. So hit that enable custom font. Now what you're going to do right now, is come down to your search bar and hit fonts. It's gonna show font settings. And then you're gonna look up whatever font you just downloaded. I just downloaded the last dream. So we're gonna basically copy that, like that, um, that word. And then we're gonna take it over here where the custom font family is. We're gonna put last dream and that will automatically change the font for you. So then we can kind of come over to the stream manager just to test it out. So, hi, I'm GS Fear. So then when you come back over here, it's gonna change that font for your chat box. This is really, really cool because there are so many amazing fonts on thefont.com. I've never had any issues with them so far. And I really, really hope this video did help you guys. If it did, please feel free to help me out by hitting that subscribe button. Comment below saying, hey, this video helped me out a ton. And don't forget to hit that like button. And I will catch you guys next time. Peace.